finishing, you know, like finishing, you know, within, you know, top 10, just about every single race. Yep. And Yunus had the number two seed going into the brackets. RKC had the number 18 seed. But uh, as uh, Adagino's pointed out last night, I believe that uh, anybody in the top 20 of the seeds are all pretty equally skilled in the randomizer, I think. And we are off. We see the wooden sword pickup. And let's see if anybody gets the first bomb drop from this Octorok. Neither runner. Okay. So we start off even at least. There's some Gibdos on this screen, but I, I guess no one's going to... Uh... Yeah, they take too much. They take too many. Oh, hey, look at this. We've got level one right here at the level three spot. That is actually really good. Yeah. Um, you know, pretty small dungeons going to house three items here. Uh, this is something they definitely want to see early on. Immediate mugger, though. And no, I mean, Yunos goes down to Zombie Link. Or Zombie Marin, excuse me. That's actually something you do want to see, is you want to see a, uh, you know, leave your heart container um, right away, because, you know, before you find any extra heart containers, that just makes it a lot easier, you know, especially when you're routing in, you know, the um, White Sword Cave. Yeah. And it was curious, so you saw Yunos up in A immediately after that, uh, just to get his health back, but RKC decided to see at least one room before he uh, up in A and got his health back. So yeah, let's see what this level one may house. The enemy set's not terrible. I mean, Dark Nuts, you know, as long as they don't run into like eight blue Dark Nuts with uh, Wood Sword Three Hearts, they're probably okay. Um, and they might even get a bomb drop it off looks of these like those, uh, red ones. Looks like those Dark Nuts rolled vanilla. It does just look taking, like that, yes. Yeah, it's taking four um, White Sword hits to take one down. Which, of course, because it can be plus or two HP, um, to have it on shuffle is it's not too bad. And there we go. RKC does get some bombs off that dark nut. Yeah, that's going to be big. Um, not only for combat, but just when he leaves this level one, uh, just for a bit more exploration, he can get a 30 secret near start. He can open up a cave uh, on his way to the graveyard if that's what his route uh, goes towards. And that could potentially house uh, a candle. Because uh, in this flag set, uh, we are not given extra candles in the heart container caves like you probably would see on those uh, randomizer flags. Oh no, RKC gets handed. Oof. And uh, Yunos uh, um, unlocks the door down here, and we've got the blue dark nuts. So, and that is a are, potential uh, drop room. That is a potential drop room, but they are uh, blue dark nuts, and we've got four blue dark nuts, and this one's guarding a shutter door. Yeah, they take, you know, they give you two hearts of damage, and they take a lot more hits with the wooden sword. Don't know how many more hits with a wooden sword, but I think it might be one. Uh, let's see, because I think he bombed that one before. Yeah, it's, they they rolled up to nine, so they're plus one because he did two bombs on that one and then did one there sword you. step. And you know, picking up the um, compass. We got more vires here. I don't know if Yunos is going to try and bomb the vires to see if they're in the bomb dropping group tonight. Not with two, but uh, RKC might. I think. Well, no, they're just going to all sort of. Notice where that compass is, though. Mm -hmm. That's the eight blue dark nut room Ouch. where that Triforce is. And uh, um, yeah. speaking of, well, we do find a uh, do find a wood boomerang on the floor. Yeah. Um, we also you know, saw I would pick that up. So there should still be two items outstanding in this dungeon. You know, it's just going to go through the locked door that opened. And this is potentially two items. Let's see. Uh-oh. Uses a bomb. I think he meant to use the boomerang there. Ah, uh, here we go. We get the raft. Yeah. Uh, that is a required item in this flag set. It's going to open up the level four spot, whatever level may be there. Uh, but that is a, a pretty big find early on, especially right now, because he can basically leave this level and route very efficiently to the raft spot if he wants to. I wouldn't see why not. And of course, RKC is going to uh, get the raft, you know, just shortly after. Mm -hmm. We do have the map to level one, and okay. It's an interesting shape. We saw something like that uh, last night in the Crystal Saver. It was almost identical. I don't know if it was level one, but it was almost identical uh, shape, because I mentioned to uh, a friend of mine when we were watching it that it looked like a, uh, a pinwheel. And ah. I was like, yeah, that's the same shape. Interesting. I mean, technically speaking, uh, the vanilla level three is a pinwheel shape. I mean, mm. has a specific name for it, but it is basically a pinwheel. 
Ooh, you know it's getting hit by those uh, dark nuts. Interesting that he's going back here. There we go. RKC, you know, taking these dark nuts to town. We're still looking for another item. Okay, it's going to be a floor item. This could be it. Yeah, this is a drop room. And it is. It's a heart container. Yeah, so this is an interesting play right here. What do they do? You know, the, you know you got eight blue dark nuts. Uh, I don't know if RKC then saw the... Did he, did he have the boomerang? I guess he doesn't, so he's going north. Yeah, uh, it's going to be, unfortunately, be a little bit more timing item, here. Yeah. Now, now remember, you know... Oh, no, RKC didn't clear this room out because he got wall mastered. Oh, okay, I didn't see that. Yeah, Yunos yeah. picks up his heart container now, oh, and like, let's see what he does. Is he going to try to do this blue dark nut room right now? I mean, Yunos' combat is very, very good, and he's got five bombs, so I think he knows that they're nine. He just needs to place his bombs efficiently. I, I believe this is only five blue dark nuts, or... Oh, yeah, five. yeah I guess it is five. So Either that way, that's not that's great. Eight. Oh, here we go. So uh, Yunos uh, doing a clip into the moat here. Is going to be able to take down these dark nuts, whittle their health down, you know, bit by bit. Mm -hmm. And we got a 70 rupee candle near start. So that's not bad. Ouch. At least that, well, I mean, ouch, yes. I mean, but a large secret ideally should be able to cover it. There's no guarantee, of course. Yeah, but, but there's only let's... one large secret that you can access without a candle, and that is in the very northeast. That is true. And look at this. We got level four at level four. All right, so Yuno's taken down the uh, Dark Nuts, level four at level four. So Yuno's with the one O Triforce lead, but that's not really that big. I mean, you can RK is going to go back to level one when he's a bit more powered up and kind of tear through that blue Dark Nut room later in the seed. And it's so close now, to start; it's just an up and is, away. It also it is also worth noting though that once Yunos does find the recorder, which is also required, he will be able to get to the level seven spot a lot easier. Yeah, it's not that... I mean, for these runners, they're going to screen scroll, and so it's it's going to save maybe 10 seconds. <laughs> you know what, uh, You know overall. what though? With the evenly matched players, 10 seconds is all it takes. Um, that is true. The race that I watched um, came down to, like, basically... Like, like I think it was, like, two seconds yeah. part. Yeah. yeah, all these all these players are going to get any advantage they can. As we see, RKC uh, snuffs the... Uh, inferior model, the Bloomerang, uh, in level 4 on the ground. I agree with that play, by the way. If you already have the, uh... Well, he doesn't even have the other Boomerang, unless uh, the yeah. tracker is... Yeah, he's, prob it. he's probably not uh, opting for any of the Boomerangs, because that, you know, that does take up extra space. And it does. Yeah, you know, for item cycling, you know. Oh, there we go, he does pick the Boomerang up, after okay. all. So he's like maybe thinking, oh, maybe it'll be useful against. It is useful against enemies that have shuffled down to zero HP. Mm -hmm. It's good for stun locking some enemies, but I think it's more important right now for picking up items across rooms, especially across rooms of where you don't have a ladder. Um, um, there we go. RKC on PowerPoint presentation strats here. And it was That's interesting right. because we just saw, we saw the item, uh, it was the Triforce, but the, mm -hmm. uh, you know, but the uh, door hadn't opened yet. So it was like just the exact frame, the, you know, the item comes out first and then the doors, uh, the doors open one by one. <laughs> so it looked like there's an item in the room, but is that Ganon's room or is that Zelda's room? I know yeah. it was just the, uh. yeah, just the connection. That's all. And it looks like level four is segmented. Yeah, gonna have uh, uh, one staircase in this because level four normally does not have a staircase, a transport staircase. Yeah, it's gonna it's gonna uh, have one runners. transport staircase, so it's gonna have two staircases. One of the item, one's mm -hmm. the item, and one is the um, the two. And it looks like Yunos also yeah. picked up the inferior model. Interesting. Yeah, I don't know if that's just a you know it was in my way you know kind of thing. <laughs> Here, here's the thing: it's you're in race mode. This is, I mean, it's not the wand. It's not going to actively hurt me. Just pick it up and keep moving. Yeah. You know, it's right. uh, memes are, I guess, I guess memes are for the weeklies. <laughs> well, RKC does find the uh, transport stair here to the south. And Let's what we got here? Oh, just a fiver. 
compass he doesn't need. Alright, so nothing in the south, but Yunos has found the item. Let's see what it is. Ooh, the, the white, white sword. sword. That is very nice. Very nice this early. Uh, I mean, really nice, you know, regardless of when you're in the sea, but especially this early when you're on low hearts uh, and it can be used to a great advantage uh, for all the upcoming dungeons that you're going to do. So he has both items now. He's going to go grab his Triforce and take a two to one uh, Triforce lead here over RKC when RKC does pick up that Triforce. Well, we might wait a little bit. Yeah, you know what? You know, Gurias are, you know, nasty when it comes to their boomerang shots. I think they cheat. Well, of course the computer cheats. <laughs> All right, RK has I mean, uh, is going to explore a bit more of this dungeon. He had a key advantage, uh, but has kind of whittled back down because he's exploring a few more rooms than Yunos did in this dungeon to get to the item that he wants to see. Both our runners doing pretty good on the bombs here. And there we go. Yep. And that's level four for Yunos. Now, I don't think we found the floor item yet. Oh, it was the bloomerang. It was on the ground. Oh, already. that's right. The bloomerang. Yes. Yep. Sorry. It's, it's a thoroughly forgettable item. <laughs> I do not blame you. Yep. So uh, Yunos is out and it looks like he is uh, going to do some money making game strategies. Yunos, the champion of money making game, really... Uh, pioneered uh, some of these strats uh, to get up uh, the rupee count, manipulating the money-making game to get the plus 50 every time. It's also nice to mention, too, that that shop that has the candle also has the blue ring. I mean, we're, we're hoping that, well, there we go. Didn't realize it before, but there's our whiz robes. Yeah, on the overworld is actually probably good. Uh, that means we will not see them in the dungeons. Yes. Well, we've got the dark nets in the dungeons, and they're uh, fun enough to deal with on their own. Mm -hmm. All right, so Yunos has his candle heading into the normal vanilla level 1, which houses level 5 today. So, so far this seed's been, you know, relatively good. And there we go, we got a bomb upgrade for 99 rupees. Almost vanilla. Almost vanilla. We don't know how much it's going to be first, but it looks like we're going to be playing Where's the Bomb Hole because there's not really else. Oh, well, there we go. <laughs> maybe not. <laughs> oh, but oh, maybe still. We can't bomb downwards. Ooh, RK taking a death, it seems. Uh, he did get the Triforce. I think he was, maybe he died trying to get into that cave, because it looks like he opened it up but didn't get the small secret. Has enough for his blue candle. Not going to take the blue candle right now, though. Yeah, might be holding off for a red candle, or, you know, just maybe not going to be routing uh, down that way yet. Yeah, he knows uh, that that store... Uh, so the interesting thing with this flag set is that uh, while the shop contents are randomized, the caves are not, so... That store on the overworld is is multiplied a few times across the overworld, so they I, will contain the same contents uh, all I'm, over the overworld for that one. Yeah, if I'm not mistaken, I believe that particular one is also found. Uh, yeah, I think it's in a cave next to uh, next to the uh, you know level eight entrance. Yes, it's over in the forest. Over in the forest, yeah, but not the one under the tree. I believe the one under the tree is the vanilla ninety rupee shield. Um, so the one on the coast is not that one. That one's the same as the uh, oh, graveyard one by the Yarmos. Okay, yeah. um, oh, no, I'm not. I'm the not... one basically north of that uh, in the forest, actually, is the candle shop normally. Oh, the... oh well, if it's. Yeah, no, I'm, I know. That's why I said a ca... that's why I said a cave in the forest. Yes. Because, yes, yeah, cave that... in the forest. That's also a... up by level five. As well. It's also it's also the uh, screen that replaces level three in second quest. Yes, correct. Uh, Yunos no, having a hard time in level 5, yeah. It, it, even though with the white sword, four hearts is not great going against some blue dark nuts sometimes, because only two hits and you're done. Yunos yeah, is going to call it quits. 
it's yeah, it's okay. So uh, we're getting confirmation in chat that the fires are still all four HP. Okay. Yeah, Eunice is gonna call it quits. Gonna screen scroll over here, check this, uh, see if the Armos item has been shuffled. Yeah, doesn't have any bombs to open up this cave though. Well, it doesn't matter anyway because we already know he already has the candle, so he wouldn't really need to go looking. Uh, if the arrows are important later. Ooh, a book. Ooh, a yeah, book. We're not yeah. Gonna, not gonna take that. So, yeah, unfortunately, Yunos is not the green leaf effect, so he's not gonna be grabbing that book. No. Uh, and we saw the bloomerang come into play. Uh, that, that was a uh, uh, heads up play to just stun it and take a look before, you know, swinging down into it. I think a lot of other players might have, you know, swung and, and gone right into it and accidentally picked up that book, and that would have been. Uh, detrimental, especially if they pick up the wand, uh, those fire beams do damage you as well. And create lag. Both and bonos in the... So we've got level BG. 7 here at the level... Uh, ooh, we've got an instant ladder block. We can go left, but only with a key. And that is something to consider. We don't really have a whole lot of keys in this seat, and we got 62 arrows. Yeah, Munos is going to nope right out. Let's see if RK picks up the book here. Yeah, I think nope. Yunos is going to, uh, you know, do uh, get the coast heart here. It's probably going to head up towards uh, level 8. Might check out what's on the coast. Yeah, so he's going to grab this heart. Can... No, he's not. He's gonna he doesn't have a bomb. Secret. He doesn't oh, have yeah, a bomb so he doesn't to have open. Bombs. Yeah. So he's going to see how big the 100 secret is. 132! That's pretty good. Yeah, I, I would agree with that. Now what he's going to do. Um, maybe he's going to try and... You know, maybe he's going to go towards uh, that. Yeah, maybe he's going to go up and grab the heart over here. Yep. And he uh, he could grab the nope. heart. No. Nope. Okay. Maybe he's... Well, uh... usually, most, uh, most racers usually leave that particular take any spot. Oh, you know what he's going to do? He's going to go right back to level 5 and he is going to buy that upgrade. That's a, yeah, heads up play. Uh, we'll That's see how plan. much he gets out of it. But he's going to get, you know, at least 9... <laughs> Actually, you might even get at least 10. Can you have one uh, as a bomb upgrade, or can it have it has to be two? I know, the minimum is two. Okay. And speaking of which, nope, that's a vanilla four. So we're basically one rupee off from complete vanilla. Yep. But not bad at all. I'll take, uh, you know, 100 secret to get 12 bombs. Yeah, 12 bombs for uh, 99 rupees. That's still a good deal. Yeah, and now we got our first divergence of the game, really. Uh, you know, they both noped out a level five. RKC is, uh, you know, going to try to explore a bit more of the seven than Yunos did, and we'll see if you know which of these might house anything really important for yeah. our runners. So yeah, well, Yunos noped out a seven. Uh, RKC is yapping it into seven. Yeah, yeah, this could be a difference maker. Gliok in this room that RK is in is uh, somewhat yeah. easy, but also somewhat annoying if you get hit. With the beams, it's actually pretty straightforward, but if you get hit, it can be a nightmare. Unfortunately, with the white sword, it's going to take a far less hits than the wooden sword. And he gets a key out of it, which is good because he didn't have any keys before. This has definitely been a key start starved seed so far, so... And level now five. we're getting uh, confirmation from chat that he uh, found a heart container on the floor in level 7, so he is only looking for the stair item at this point, RK is. Yep, RK gonna do the right thing and uh, use up some of those bombs, and oh, hey, look, we've got ourselves a ladder block on Yunos' side. Uh oh. You know, we've got our uh, patented danger noodles uh, guarding this staircase over here in 7. Manages to take them down. There is a key there on the floor. Probably going to go back and pick that up because he doesn't have any more keys. Yeah, just wants to make sure he exits the room uh, to make sure the boss doesn't come back. Oh, we got another ladder block here. And unfortunately, we, right. no, we can bomb downwards, so that's good. Now here's a Might potential item. item room. Actually, this is yes, wow. our item room, and it is the bow. That is important. Yeah, 
All right, so a bow and five. Uh, you know, I can't see RK. I mean, he has to go back to that dungeon anyway, and he's probably going to get that. It's just a matter of, is that going to be advantageous in the time that RK doesn't have it? You know, everybody, everybody talks about, you know, getting the power items early is, is a great thing. Yes, but if it doesn't slow the other runner down, you know, it's not a huge hindrance. But, yeah. you know, getting, getting the arrows purchased or finding the silver arrow next would be uh, a great thing for Yunos to do. Yeah, usually when it comes down to the bow, usually the only two things that have an, usually have an impact are uh, if there's a lot of pulse voices in the seed. Mm -hmm. Or if we run into a lot of Goma blocks, then True. then not having the bow and arrows is going to be incredibly detrimental to the other player. And I've actually seen races where having the bow, you know, being able to kill those pulls voices without having to wail on them with the sword, made you know a lot of, made a big difference in the ra how the race went. Yeah, and I mean the benefit here is that they do have the white sword, so that you know Poles voices will go down in half the time. So it's not a it's it's a less of an impact for sure, but still yeah. an impact depending on how they rolled. I mean, then there's also the fact that if you have the bow and silver arrows, you have less items that you need to be digging out of other mm -hmm. uh, dungeons. Mm -hmm. Ooh, RKC! Wow, <laughs> almost stuck in the corner from those Poles voice. Really good movement to not get hit. Yeah, this looks like a dungeon where uh, the arrows would actually be pretty useful. RK on half a heart, Yunos on two hearts. This is... Wow. Some of this combat you're seeing is dangerous, but they are, you know, going in head first. They're on point today, so... And we do have a, you know, patented shoot room. Alright, Yunos finds the transport. RK still trying to find his uh, stair item in seven here, and the Triforce. Seven looks there. There's Triforce. Seven looks a bit small on the small side. Quite interesting. I think a lot of it is because uh, there's uh, it's got less um, it's got less width and more height to it. Mm -hmm. And I think are that's you, are what you I... saying it's are you saying it's an optical illusion? Well, what I, what I'm saying yeah, well, what I'm saying is is that. Uh, when usually you see those giant beasts of a levels, usually they're, you know, like longer and skinnier, and they're going all the way from the left side of the, you know, left side of the map to the right side. And this one's a little bit, because I mean, it's still the same amount of rooms. If you just shuffle things around a little bit, you'd easily make it more imposing. I guess the best way to put it is, is level seven is thick. <laughs> all right. Also, level five definitely looks like a dinosaur. I can see it. I was going to say maybe like a grenade. Oh, you know what? I think level seven looks kind of like Popeye. A little bit. Okay, yeah, I see the jawline. Yeah. Yeah. So it looks like Yunos is out of level five here. And RK is leaving level 7, so both picked up the Triforce. I don't know if Yunus, Yunus found the floor item in 5, and I don't know if RK found the floor or the stair item in 7. I didn't see it. If uh, somebody in chat or a tracker can put that up, uh, it'd be great to know. But I didn't see it. Yeah. RK now with 5 hearts, I think he might be going for a white sword check. Now that would, which uh, is that an would interesting mean, play. Yeah, that'd mean checking out oh, no, the lost boys. He is going up to vanilla level 9, early yeah. Death Mountain play. Yeah, yeah, that's where your RKC is going. I think Yunos is going to start doing the level. Probably start by, uh, you know, looking into uh, the level 8 location. Yeah, he's going to go down and get this... Oh, I thought he was going to go down and get oh, a heart container. He's going to do a head clip. The swag clips. Yeah, that's going to allow him to uh, clip all the way over to here. Is just going to be able to clip over in here, and now he can't go that way, but he can go this way here, and he's going to go check out the coast. Yeah, see what's oh. laying on the coast for us. If arrows are in here, he's buying them. Yep, there they yeah. are. And uh, we do have level two up at level nine. Okay. So Spectacle Rock is an entrance to Moon. 
Red ring on the coast. Ooh, that's really good. And we still need to locate that ladder. And we have seen some ladder blocks, and we got level 9 here at, at level 8. Alright. Good to get that out of the way, but not really what he wants to see. Usually I kind of just like to see level 9 as the my last dungeon. Yeah, yeah. level 9 level nine's not progression, and any item that's blocking level 9 is also not progression, at least, at, at least you know, in terms of, hey, here's level 8. Another ladder block. See, and level 2 is going to block two rooms. I don't know if there was enemies in that room of the uh, Chevy room, but at least one room is blocked in level two that could house an item. So similar color palette here, different dungeons. Uh, Yunos is in level eight, it's gonna have three items, two stair, one floor. Uh, RK in level two is gonna have two floor items. Uh, another route divergence here that uh, is going to be very interesting to see. Yunos picks up a Triforce, though. Ah, it's an easy Triforce out of eight. Yeah, I actually like this play. Uh, I don't know if he got knocked into it uh, sort of unnecessarily, but no, he's good. He's just going to take off. That's an interesting play. You know, he's got three items in there, but says, you know, that eight is big. I got other places to be. Let's see what else is out there before I go back uh, into eight. Now, we do see the Triforce in level two, um, you know, uh -huh. over here um, in this particular location. So uh, not too difficult to reach. But now we've got, you know, one key and two key doors. He's going to go north. He's going to ignore that one off. Uh, that one off could still contain one of our items. Yeah, Muno is picking up his sixth heart container, guaranteeing him whatever white sword item may be up there. So we'll you know, see if he's going to check this before going into the vanilla five spot or after. Now it's also noticed that we've already seen all our garbage items. So it's either going to be a heart container or it's going to have some value. That's true. So it might it might even be the step ladder. Yeah. Come on, step ladder. Mm. Nope, just a heart container. Darn. He worked. He worked all his way to get up here. He's going to take it. Yeah, well, I mean, it's another heart container. Um, you don't know how the health is going to be in this seed. You may end up with uh, enough to go do Magic Sword. Um, Yunos yeah. is not likely to go make a play for Mags. This is not going to be one of no. those seeds. I don't think either one is probably going to make a play for Mags, especially when they already have the White Sword. I wouldn't be surprised if Yunos picks up no other hearts unless they're literally on the ground in front of him in his way. Yeah, um, speaking like, of which... Like Ar Ar RKC had, and yeah... <laughs> So is that the first item in level That would be here? the first item, and we've got ourselves a Patra here. And we got level 6 at the uh, Lost Hills location. And there come those arrows. Yep, already uh, those wooden arrows are being put to good use. Yep, as Chad is pointing out, uh, we are only missing uh, level 3, and that is going to be under Recorder Lake. Yeah, but unfortunately, the recorder itself is also missing. Mm -hmm. RK taking a death to that Patra. Even with the white sword, you gotta be careful. Yeah, those Patras are, uh, they can be quite annoying. Map Here we six. go, there's lap of level six. Mm, it's another grenade. There is a possibility for some ladder blocks. Wow, what what combat by Yunos there. Didn't even get hit, stabbing through, and is rewarded with an item that is the heart container. And as I said, uh, that's an extra, like, 12 to 15 seconds to go pick that up there. He's not going to Yeah, and like I said, at this, at this point, you know, um, every second counts. And uh, since uh, Yunos already did find the staircase item, he's going to nope out of that room full of danger noodles. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if Yunos found a, tr a Triforce here uh, pretty early if he would just take it and run, uh, knowing that the second item is a floor item. But he's running out of some places to go. He's going to have to make a decision to try to dig something. He still has the Death Mountain level 9, uh, which we know to be level 2, uh, yet to explore. And still three items on the ground, uh, inside, excuse me, on uh, level 8. Yeah, well, he might, you know... If the if he can find a stepladder here in level six, 
Mm-hmm. Then you know that would that would make a level two a lot easier because then there's uh, the eliminating that one particular ladder block that we just don't know whether that could be the end. That could very well be their recorder in two. We just don't know yet. Yep. So RK is going to join Unos in level six here. So Yunos is already up to seven keys, and meanwhile RKC has, you know, big old goose egg. Yeah, that's not great going into something like level six, but we did see already some keys on the ground. Uh, Let's we'll see if he gets blocked by anything. Yunos definitely up on the resources here. He's got the arrows, he's got more bombs, and he's got way more keys. And it looks like we've got a potential ladder uh, block situation here in six. Yep. Uh, not uh, probably not likely. Wow! Look at Unos. <laughs> they were in the same room, and Unos spent uh, about three seconds in there, whereas RK kind of has to clip this and is just going to have to wait on these uh, blue and mola to come to him. Mm -hmm. Oh, don't die! Oh, he's trying to Kananaki. There we go. He gets a Kananaki off the blue land molas. That's spicy. With half a heart, my god. He still has half a heart. He's got to dodge this room. Okay. Okay, now he's got a heart and a half. There's a bomb refill room for Yunos. All right, this Pulse Voice room could house something, and this could be a big difference. Uh, that has well, a compass. A compass. That's not terrible. Yeah, he's probably going to grab the compass on the way back. Yeah, he, well, he only has, like, six more rooms to explore anyway. The compass is a little... Yeah, I mean, it's it's better... If, if you know this is kind of going to be, like, a dead-end section, you're better off leaving the compass and then coming back afterwards mm -hmm. instead of grabbing the... Sometimes you're... You know, sometimes you uh, get a little bit greedy, and it's like, oh, I want to grab that. But then I have to go all the way back to the other side of the room, and here we go. I believe they are in the same room, and that's... Oh, for a second. Yeah. So, yeah, Yunus knows now where that Triforce is. Just you know, wants to find this floor item, because he's already invested enough time in this level six. He's going to check out the floor item. There it is. It's there the it PB. Is. I think he's sort you of okay. Maybe there's a little lag there. He's like, yeah, I, I don't know if he wants that or not. It's not the greatest thing, especially when you've already done this level five spot. Yeah. Um, and you know, it would be the most beneficial to up an A and then uh, get up to the northeast here. But he's gonna clear this out. Oh. Okay. Well, we can go this way. Uh oh. Oh dear, we've got a ladder block. Yep. And he's going to have to get out of here. So picking up that uh, that power bracelet actually could come into play. That's, yeah. So yeah, sometimes, sometimes that you don't know what's going to happen. So that's uh, interesting. He's going back in? No. Nah, oh, he, he, got, he got knocked back in accidentally. Okay. There was whiz robes out here that immediately pushed him back. He got wide dungeoned. Mm -hmm. All right, so Yunos is out. Gonna go. I'm assuming uh, go check out the uh, vanilla level nine spot. Gonna find level two, and let's see if he can do anything more than RK did in there. We know that there is a heart container on the ground, and I think that's all we know. RK did get the that and the Triforce. Hmm. So yeah, so yeah so that's right there still is a floor item remaining in level five isn't there uh yes i don't believe we saw that and uh level we do seven is have... uh, you know staircase item so mm -hmm. either one of those could potentially be the step ladder we also don't know anything in eight yep we're still missing you know for sure what we're missing that we need is the uh, recorder and the silver arrow the step ladder would be uh well and actually we know we knew we know we need the step yeah ladder we know the step ladder is uh, required the triforce I just love watching 
Yunos's combat in this room. Even though he takes a death, like he's still, you know, taking no mercy and no prisoners against these uh, dark nuts. Just getting in there uh, knows how the movement and bo both of his own character plus the dark nuts and how they're probably going to react. It's just really nice to watch as he does this. Yeah, that's where all that practice, uh, you know, comes into play. Yep. Uh, that's, yeah, that's that's also where the uh, vanilla, vanilla, you know, vanilla strats or uh, should I say uh, vanilla any percent uh, is good too, because the vanilla any percent run that definitely requires a lot of combat, a lot of uh, forcing ten count bombs. Mm -hmm. So here we've got a staircase, and we already found both items. I'm not sure that RK has found the uh, the heart container in the stair quite yet. Not sure. So I I don't remember. Did uh, RKC take down the patcher that was up here? I don't uh, recall. I think he uh, died and didn't go back, so we'll have to okay, see. Okay, so so that'll be interesting because uh, if there's an item up here, you know that could uh, mm -hmm. give you know a bit of an advantage. Agreed. There is a heart that's container. The, that's the first of the heart. Con that's the heart container that we did see. Mm -hmm. And here's the patra. It's an you know it's an elliptical uh, patra. Yeah, Yunos can take one bef one hit before he's in danger. Yeah. This is the easier of the Patchers to deal with. Well, I mean, both Patchers are still kind of... There we go. Uh, Yunos timing is hit so that... Uh, okay, so that's just the compass. Okay, good but news Yunos for RK was, there. But, I, but Yunos was timing his hits against the Patcher to make sure that uh, the invincibility, or should I say the uh, iframes, uh, overlapped Link. Mm-hmm. If you uh, if you slashed him too soon, then you know his iframes iframes would disappear, and you know the patch would just hit him. Yeah, and Yunos is going to take the Triforce. He might think that uh, he's not going to open up that key door to the right. So maybe if maybe he found another item and we just don't know it. You know what? I would take the chance on the key door, honestly. Okay. Well, he's and going back like in. So yeah, going to, I don't think, actually. I don't think he saw the ladder block. Okay, so he might take the key over here first, and he's gonna see the ladder block in one more room. But you know, at this at the, this point in time, you're missing the this. You're missing the ladder. You're missing mm -hmm. the recorder. You're missing the silver arrows. Uh, you your your key situation is actually a lot better than your opponent. Uh, you might not know that, but it's like, you know, taking a chance on those one offs. I would, I would do that. Yeah, especially this early on, and he's got opportunities to get money for more keys if he needs okay, so, so this is interesting we were uh, masters in some this, enemies uh, here so we'll see if this leads to something nope. okay so there's no item so our item is either past that uh, moat block or it's still going to be possible that it is uh, in one of those one-off uh, you know, rooms. Yeah, I'm not sure if RK opened up that room to the right of the Triforce. We'll have to see. No, he didn't. He was pretty low on keys, so I don't think he did. I don't did. think he had I any wouldn't. Dude, I don't think he was capable of uh, opening it if he wanted to. Yeah, there's that one room. Let's see if Yunos decides to do it. Nope, he's going to say, um, for oh, one room, I'm not going to do yeah, it. Yeah, well, you see, and you see, that's where, that's where I understand, but I would disagree. And it's the difference. I mean, he knows that, uh, you know... I mean, he can it's it's yeah it's a it's a it's a play like i can't fault it uh but it could be a bad uh bad news i mean but both of our runners have kind of made that choice so it's not going to affect you know them disproportionately right now ah so you know did in fact pick up the power bracelet yes he did and he is going towards level seven he doesn't have anything out of here so uh, i agree with this play at least go here before going back to eight uh but rk is in level eight uh, and we might see if he picks up items. Well, 
if we can see him picking up items. Right now, uh, right now he's having a little bit of artifacting going on his screen, so. I'm going to keep track of his heart container series. And there we eight. go. Here's the floor item in seven. It was the heart container. Mm -hmm. We already saw that. Nice dodging. And yeah, we're seeing the combat advantage of the arrow already right now. RK dealing with a lot of Poles voices and just taking, a, you know, more time in these rooms, you know, 10 to 20 more seconds in these rooms than Yunos would. And RK did spend a decent amount of time in the 7, I feel, and didn't get... Uh, much out of it beyond the Triforce uh, and that heart container. So we'll see if Yunos can sniff out the uh, the floor item. Sorry, the stair item in here. So we know this is the uh, transport staircase. Mm -hmm. He's not going to take it. He's going to opt to take down the land molas. Won't get... Well, that was the... They can't get a Kanana key. He's got enough keys as it is. Mm-hmm. Here we go. Um, it looks like RKC taking the Triforce. This could be a potential staircase room, unless I think uh, RK saw this. I don't think it's anything, actually. Yeah. Yeah, it's just a key drop. That's I mean, for RK, way. that's definitely something. Because uh, he I, still only got just got one key. And here we go. We got. I think this is new territory in level seven. Yeah. I don't know if RK bombed up here. Oh, you know, so oh, my gosh. Oh, come on, you know, don't die. I don't think he's too far from the entrance, but even so. Alright, I like this RK going back into 8 to see if we can find something else. So this could be a big play here, but I think Yunos is sort of ahead enough that uh, if something is an 8, he's going to go back to 8 within, you know, basically after he's done with 7 here. Yeah. Well, that doesn't open. Okay. Some troll rooms on Yunos' side in level 7 here. Let's find another bomb hole. There's a shoot room. The shoot room could contain something interesting. Yep, yeah, could house an item. It does normally in vanilla level 3. But that bow, not having it, is really hurting him in a room like this. Speaking of not having it, looks like RKC is not having it with that bubble in the center, and Oh, hey, look, mm -hmm. we've got a Goma. Yep, uh, so... And just another uh, transport. And unfortunately, run into another ladder block there in 7. Yeah, I'd say level 8 at this point. Level 8 might be the play. Here's a uh, staircase. Yeah, I don't know if we saw this on Yunos' side. He was down in this area, so he might have already seen this. No, wow. No, oh, because there's the stepladder. Okay, so... RKC has a lead in this particular department. Yeah, I got to imagine that Yunos is going to get frustrated in the 7, same as RK, if he doesn't find the item soon enough. And he might just pull the Triforce and get out, and he's going to go back to 8. Like, there's really no other play to, to make at this point. Yeah, it looks like a lot of this level 7 is, uh, you know, ladder blocked. And there's a heart container on the ground in 8 as well. So now, the next question is, though, is what is the third item in 8? If it's the um, if it's the recorder, um, yeah, that, that would be good. Or if it's the silver arrows. Ooh, another Patra. It's also worth noting, too, that with that stepladder, uh, RKC can go back to the coast and pick up that uh, red ring. Yeah, he'll do that right after this, I'm sure. So he's going to have the defensive advantage, but, uh, you know, Yunos is a player, even with the uh, green tunic strats, he's not going to die all that much. 
and he's not going to be slowed down in rooms all that much. So we'll see what advantage that could give RK. But remember, RK does not have the bow. That is true. He still has to go back to five, which is but not you know a where? place that he'll probably go very soon. But I, we did see some ladder blocks in level five, so it is possible that you know, if he goes back and digs out level 5 and does find something such as the Recorder or the Silver Arrows, then then that that would actually give him more of an advantage even more, you know, even further. Mm -hmm. So, you know, that, that's the interesting thing about the routing is, you know, where you go and what you do, depending upon what items you find and, you know, how much you decide to dig a dungeon before realizing maybe I need to come back later. Yeah, Yunus is trying to decide that right now. He's seen almost all of this level 7 and still hasn't found that item. And he might just be saying, yeah, I'll get this Triforce and get out. It looks like that we do have a la I think we have a ladder blocked item in level 7. Yeah. Now here we go. This could be our potential second uh, staircase item in eight. Now, of course, what our KC would love to see right now is, of course, the any key. With only one key to his name. What do we got? Does it push? No. Nothing. Another... One key, one bomb here. You know it's going to save out a level 7, and let's see if he makes the play to 8. I would not be surprised if that is his play right now. There it is, the third item in 8, and it's a heart container. That means level... You know what? That means level two or level seven have to ha has to have some progress. Mm -hmm. So that ladder definitely was required. I mean, we know well. We know level six uh, is Triforce was also ladder block too, but but yeah, I would I would think that RKC would head back to level two. Yeah, and you know, it's going back into five for the floor item that we still haven't seen. No, I. I do believe we did find a ladder block here in five, and that might have been blocking the floor item. Possible. RK uh, doing a quick trip into eight, but realizing, you know, I got everything, I gotta leave. As chat's pointing out, I think he forgot that he picked up the Triforce. Uh, yeah. and when you do that so early and so long ago, it's easy to forget that. Because sometimes you'll leave the Triforce uh, for the last thing you do to make sure you get the refill coming out, and sometimes it's it's more advantageous to pick up the Triforce uh, and then go back in for the item so you can just up and A out really quickly. RKC gonna pick up that uh, red ring. Could have gone north and picked up a potion or another heart container. That would have given him a, uh, you know, a fair shot at the magic sword. Yeah, at this point, he's already done level 7 over there by the magical sword. I don't think he plans on going back unless he absolutely has to. And, yeah, well, I mean, that's uh, just... That, that heart container is quite out of the way. Yeah. He's going back into level 1 to get his Triforce. I agree with this play. He's got the red ring now. Just go clear it out. You're here. All right, so you know, still trying to dig this five. If this has like a recorder somehow, if you can get it somehow and it has the recorder, well, it might be the uh, recorder. that would be the best thing. Yeah, but that, that depends on whether or not the recorder is blocked or not. Yeah. And here's a, uh, oh yeah, that's right. We never actually uh, went through this particular mugger room. Now, if I remember correctly, it's the floor item in five we're still looking for. Correct. Bo, Bo was in the uh, stair. So, yeah, Yunos had already cleared out for the for the bow, and there's the uh, Triceforce where one for RKC. 
And this is a room we have not been in on uh, Yunos' side, and it is nothing. That yep. sucks. He, he didn't have a key before, and it was blocked by the ladder on the other side, and he thought that room probably houses it. But I think there's one other uh, room on the left that he might be able to get to. We'll see. And yeah, as chat's pointing out, he might have to go through that mugger room here. I just want to note that uh, RKC is back in level 1. I guess he's trying to bomb, or he's trying to farm bombs off the Dark Nuts. He might not have gotten the one... There's one item down here I don't think he oh, saw. Oh, yes, that's I think it's right. a floor item that he never saw. Right. Yeah. Unfortunately, it's not going to do him any good, since he has the, uh... Hmm. Yeah, the other, other model. And yeah, this is a forced mugger room. You know it's going to give away the heart container, and this pretty much has to be the floor item. No, maybe not. Wow, what Ooh. is this? He's been in every room. Has he? It looks like it. Was there another... Was there something blocking him in there? Was there a dig dogger? Or... I don't know. I did not see any dig doggers. Um, I think I did either. You know what? There might have there might have been a Chevy room. Possible. I yeah. It, if there was it's a hard Chevy to see room, everything that's Chevy going room on. would contain the item. Mm -hmm. But Yunos is making the correct play right now. I think going back uh, towards level uh, eight. Yeah, level eight for sure. It's going to do a more HUD clip here. It's just the faster way and the safer way to get through the forest. And yeah, if. If RK finds this floor item and it turns out to be something good in level 5 here, uh, that could be potentially very bad for Yunos, because I don't think he's going to go back to 5 now, yeah. sort of, before doing everything else. But there still are two, you know, important items at large, so even if it houses one, RK still has to go somewhere else to find the last. Yeah. Either 9 or, uh, you know, 2 or 7. It's just really quickly, it's, it's a matter of how quickly does Yunos do this level 8, and he's going to do it a lot quicker than RK did, because remember, we saw a bunch of Pole's voice in here, and he has the bow and arrow. Yeah, so uh, Yunos is definitely going to be able to make up some lost time, just with the combat advantage. Yeah, Chad is pointing out when he does find the bow in here, he doesn't have the RK, that, that is, doesn't have the money to buy the arrows quite yet, but can get pretty easy money. Uh, you know, 132 right. large secret. I don't think he's picked up uh, any of them. But RK might, uh, if uh, RK manages to pull out the silver arrows from mm -hmm. this dungeon, then he won't need to buy keys at all. Yeah. Or buy arrows, you mean? Yeah. Yeah. Or keys. I mean, he's still down to two keys, where Yunos has six. That's another advantage that could come into play later. If RK goes into go mode right now, you know, he's not going to probably be searching for a lot of keys in the dungeons. Uh, and that, you know, going into nine with low key count could could change things. Now, now did RK uh, finish this room here? No, I don't think he did. Yeah, and there's just a key on the, gr on the ground. Something RK would absolutely love to see right about now, but unfortunately... Yeah, RK did find all the items in here uh, for level 8. So I think if Yunos goes north... Yeah, good. Go back, Yunos. Go back. Go north. I think north of him right now is uh, the ladder. Or maybe it's north... Uh, north... Northwest. Yes, in this direction. I think Yunos is going to get his ladder if he goes north from here. No, no, I, no. you know what it is? It's in the... Uh, I think it's in the section... Was it here? I think no, it's I... here. It's definitely something here, so he'll get some information. There it is. Yeah, there we go. All right, so big for Yunos. He found that a heck of a lot quicker. And now he still has an item or two. I don't know if he saw the heart container on the ground. Uh, I actually don't remember what the uh, second item in 8 is. Did you catch it? Um, the Was second it another heart I... container? Yeah, it might have been another heart container. Two hearts and a ladder. Thank you, Boletta. Yep. Our tracker coming through. Two hearts and a ladder. Two hearts, Two hearts and a ladder. And a ladder. <laughs> well, 
oh, there's the red candle in five, so... Okay, so red oh, candle, that's... That was ladder blocked. That was entirely ladder blocked. Wow. That's, that's why we couldn't find it in five, because it was ladder blocked. Mm -hmm. Which makes sense, and that is actually really big for Yunos, because I don't think he's going to go back to level five until... Yeah. Way late. <laughs> But that definitely now he's not going to go that, back to level five. But that also means that level two has got to have something. Uh, two or seven, right? Now uh, it's, seven still has a ladder block, and it, we're still looking for the stair item in there. Yeah, two and seven, because we we can't get to three. Now three could also have the silver arrows. That's true. So we yeah, two or seven or both, we don't know. Now it what really bothers me though is that there was that one locked door. That none of them tried. Uh, in level two, yeah. Uh, yeah. Again, I don't blame RK for not doing that. And you know, you know, again, he's down to four keys now. If he did it, he would be down to three. Well, you know, for he still had a lot of other places to go, and the keys are at a premium sometimes. So I can't, yeah. I can't blame well, him. One of the well, one of the big things about randomizers juggling all sorts of different things. You know, mm -hmm. you know that you have about like 150 things you have to do, and then now you've got to organize them in such a way that they all flow together. Um, there's the bow for RKC, but yeah, you've got to make everything flow together because otherwise you're going to be like, oh, I got this item now, I can go back here. But maybe I should, you know, it's like you want to go, but it's like you want to see what everything is. Like, that's the reason yeah. why I don't speed run, you know, and do that. Because I'm like, I want to go back here and look at this and see what this leads to. And I'm more curious than, you know, winning. Fair enough. Yeah. You're a completionist is what you are. I kind of am a completionist, yeah. All right, so Yunos just tearing through this level eight with the bow and arrow. I be I know that the uh, heart container on the floor is in a reverse C room in level eight. This might be the second item here. The second heart container. Yep. Yep, there it is. Yeah, and I don't think he's going to pick up... Definitely not picking up that one. He might pick up the other one, uh, you know, just because it's an easy grab whenever he does... If he does find it. Um, but he's already got the Triforce out of here, so yeah, he is digging to get that last item. Because, yeah, still missing that recorder, still missing those silvers. You're already in here. You don't got many more rooms to go. Let's do it. Yeah, both of our runners explored a decent amount of seven, so at least they know... I think they did... And so you got level two, it's about the same amount of rooms unexplored, I think, in level two as it is at level seven. Uh, both of them are kind of out of the way. Uh, you know, this is kind of a, a psych game, I think, of, you know, which one do you think maybe your opponent might go to first? Uh, you know, which one do you think it would be more advantageous based on what your opponent might do? Well, level two is uh, definitely a lot easier just in the fact that it's just, you know, the size. So be like, I know exactly where I need to go in level two. You know, you know, it's not going to bother. Nope, maybe he is. Nope, he's not going to bother. So he's seen all the items. He should be up and aing out of here. Yep. Yeah, he's got to consult the tracker. Mm hmm. So yeah, now he's deciding. Okay, he's like, all right, I got that one in five now. I've got. Uh, something in level 7 and something in level 2. And he still has to go back to 6, so it looks like he is uh, going back into 6 first. I think he might... Uh, he definitely saw both items, but he's going to get the uh, Triforce out of here. It's out of the way. Let's just go grab it real quick. Did we see what both of our level 6... Yeah, we did. Yeah. We saw it was a power bracelet and I believe another heart. Correct. Yeah. And he got both of those, uh, so he he just knows that it's ladder blocked and might as well just pick this up right now. And this actually might be a play of, you know, I want to be still doing something while I think about my next move. So Yunus is going to go do something that he doesn't have to think about uh, while he ponders where he wants to go next. You know, that's actually a very good point. Um, you know, uh, just, 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 yeah, instead of, uh, you know, stopping and... You know, think you know just to think. Yeah, sometimes it's better go like, okay, well, I'm gonna do this while I'm thinking about doing that. Yeah, yeah. So it's just that that's good. Uh, you know, good. Uh, you know, task management. 
something I'm incapable of doing. I'm more of the type of, like, I have 50 things to do, I'm just gonna sit here until I figure out which one I want to do. Alright, so RK going into 6 as well. Here we I go. Think doing a similar play. Yeah, Triforce. Yeah, Triforce out of 6. So now is the decisive play here. Uh, you know, Yunos has three items outstanding. Two, five, and seven. He's he's gonna get knocked back into six, but you know when he goes back out, uh, uh, two is the closest. Yeah, I would I would think yeah if he's going this way, I would say he's probably going to do two first. And to me, I honestly I think two is gonna be the correct play. Okay. Just to I mean, be different, the, I'm gonna say seven. But yeah, yeah, well, you know what? I you know both of them might actually be the correct play. That's true. Yeah. What what a, what a play would it be like if you know they're gonna go to they, they go to two, they pick up uh, their recorder, and then they go to three, and don't find anything, and still have to go back to seven after all, and then we get you know this sort of photo finish in level nine. Now you see, here's here's the thing. So okay, Yunos is gonna go to that one-off room. If the item is in that one-off room, then that actually means that uh, it could that item could have been obtained a lot sooner than you know. Mo mm -hmm. than, yeah. So let's yeah. see. Is there anything in here? No, it's an old oh. man. It's a bomb upgrade. So one important thing that's happening right now is RK is not just going straight for the Triforce, so he might not have seen the uh, one. He definitely didn't see one of the items in here, or maybe mistracked it. But he is digging the six, and that's just time lost right now on Yunos, who is on the hunt for the recorder. So here we go. This had some wall masters in it. No, this was a completely empty room. Oh, the wall masters are there. And there here we is. go. And there's the recorder. All right. So my dream is still alive that if level three doesn't house the silvers, then they're either in nine or seven. And then our runners have a uh, decision. Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah. That, well, I would say, I would actually say level seven would be a better. I mean, I'd go to seven nine, first. Yeah. Well, yeah, you go to level seven. At this particular rate, you know, we have seen so many free level nines that the last thing you want to do is walk into a free nine and have to full clear it just to find out that the silver arrows are not there. Yeah, and he, they've already done so much of seven. They know exactly where to go. It's uh, it's literally, you know, one minute out of the way, potentially, uh, maybe even sooner than that, versus yeah. taking maybe a bunch of stairs and nine that you don't have to. So I just want to interrupt since we don't have our audio. Um, did was that the vanilla tune? Did Yunos have the uh, name that I, tune flag on? I didn't uh, hear, so I'll, I'll try to I'm, hear. Well, I'm talking to chat. I know you wouldn't. Okay. Yeah. There's Ganon's room. Oh hi. But we saw Zelda's room earlier, and that is the magic key in three. Okay. Magic key in three. Not a bad pickup, but not what you want to see. Oh no, for sure. Well, actually, no. Give well, actually, RKC could stand to use. Well, I mean, RKC's six. got six keys now, so it's not as bad. Look at this. He's got six keys, six bombs, and he's in level six. That's. I'll just ponder RK, that for a second. RKC is the devil. I heard if you uh, play the recorder tune backwards, that's what it says. Didn't, didn't the angry video game nerd make that joke? <laughs> I don't know. I think everybody everybody's made that joke since 1965. <laughs> uh... All right. So Yunus know, knows where the Triforce is, but is definitely going to try to sniff out the uh, second item in here, knowing that the silvers are still at large. Level three is very small. Okay, RK is probably heading to level 2, which is the correct play, but Yunos is still going to have several minutes advantage here. Yeah, by not having to dig out the remainder of level 5, Yunos has definitely added a lot of extra time between him and RKC. And RKC having that level 6 exploration that we didn't think he was going to do. 
It's also right. noted that I think Yunos is still in collecting keys mode. Hasn't maybe figured out that he's got the any key? Yeah, he did. He, I mean, that was just in his way. Um, the he did skip the uh, the other key below that. And right. hello, level seven. How are you today? Do All we right. have our silvers? So. Yeah, we're down to now. They're either the stair item in 7, which was ladder blocked, or they're in level 9. I'm gonna be honest with you, uh, for RKC's um, sake, hopefully they're in level 9? Yeah, at this point. So yeah, no, if RKC can... Uh... You know, get this, you know, get, you know, not, uh, not check for, you know, anything in level three. Actually, no, I don't think he would do that necessarily, but. Maybe, yeah, maybe take a gamble and maybe the uh, silvers are in nine. Uh, I don't know, because I don't think you take that gamble and Yunos is not taking that gamble. Like I said, he knows. But Yunus didn't see this uh, the item in level 5 either, so he might actually do a quick level 5 check after this level 7 check if they are not here. Ooh. And that'll of course allow RKC to uh, gain a little bit of extra time back. And here we go, this is the- ooh, and it's Coma Block too. Oh wow. So, so even if what? RKC came here... Uh, early on after getting the ladder, it might not, that would have been really detrimental. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ooh. Ooh, we got ourselves a level nine silver arrows. Okay, so uh, we can do a quick rundown now that we know uh, where all the items are. Uh, give a little item recap going on here. Uh, level one had our raft, our wooden boomerang, and a heart container. Level two had a heart container in the recorder, which was ladder blocked. Level 3, which was recorder blocked, had a any key and a heart container. Level 4 had the blue meringue and a heart container. Uh, level 5 had the bow and the red candle. Level 6 had a heart container and a power bracelet. Level 7 had the magical rod and a heart container. Level 8 had the ladder, a heart container, and a heart container. And that means that level 9 contains the silver arrow and, I believe, the last heart container. Oh, by the way, our book... Uh, was yeah, the was armless item. item, red ring was oh. the coast, and another heart container on the uh, old man. Yeah, well the old man had the coast heart. Yes. So Yunos making the uh, correct play here into level 9. Yep, yeah, now let's see if RKC is going to make that gamble. I didn't see when Yunus entered level 9, but I'm assuming it's probably only been about 30 to 40 seconds ago. So let's say, uh, you know, 107 conservatively. Uh, looks like RKC is uh, going back into 3, so... Thank you, Trails. Says, uh, happy birthday to you is the flute song. Well, I know a couple of people celebrating birthday today neither of them in the community, so I won't talk about it anymore. Alright, we got our first staircase, I think, here. Yeah, we got a staircase. Watch it be... Nope. Transport. I think we can have up to, like, seven transport staircase uh, pairs in level 9, along with the two six, items. Well, I believe it's a minimum of six plus yes. any uh, segments. Yes. There can be oh, segments, plus any segments in level okay. 9. Yeah. Usually I don't see more than one segment for level 9, given how big it is. Uh, but, yeah, I guess you're right. You could have some, some strange combination of, of eight transports. Eight pairs. I mean, I suppose you could, I suppose, uh, you could just add more segments at the cost of... Uh, you know, of uh, extra rooms. So, you know, just turn... But I think there's actually a limit to how many uh, how many staircases yeah. one uh, dungeon can actually contain. I'm sure there are. Uh, yeah, because uh, how, how it usually works as well, here's Ganon. Oh. Okay. Anyway, uh, unfortunately, let's see if we can bomb out of this... No, I don't want to... Oops. I think that... 
did bomb. I don't think that's going to open. I think he did see that that didn't open there. Um, it just occurred to me that I don't think Yunos went back for the red ring. Uh, he did not. That's kind of too out of the way for him at this point. He, yeah, uh, he, cause when he, when he got out of eight, he, uh, saved. Um, so yeah, he is, yeah. doesn't well, have you, the red ring, which could, well, again, could, Yunos is one of those something. kind one of those kind of, uh, you know, uh, racers that, you know, doesn't, doesn't need all those luxuries, you know, like, a, you know, extra attack or, you know, extra defense, you know, when you're really good at that, it's just, unfortunately you get caught. I mean, again, in, in a Chevy room, you're going to be guaranteed to take a hit, especially if you're not interested in, you know, killing Ganon. I mean, with a ladder, they can do it without that. But it's, yeah, it, as Adam Genos is pointing out in chat and Boletta, it's three screens away from level nine right now. So it's very, very close by. But I think both of our runners are feeling the pressure here. They know who they're up against, and it is an hour 10, and you have not seen a dot done on the other side. And who's going to be the first one to find the silver arrows, the first one to find to, to beat Ganon, and the first one to find the princess? Yeah, I think RK did not go back to level 7, if I saw that correctly. So I think he is also, you know, he's sort gambling, of... He's no, gambling on level He's gambling. Nine. So yeah, he made he's the right saying, decision. You know, he's going to make the right decision, but he I think the play in his head is that, you know, I know who I'm up against and he hasn't dot done yet. I don't think I think the silvers are a 9. He's kind of meta gaming right now. Yeah. And there's Zelda. We have a Zelda sighting. Yep, so now Ganon's got two or should I say uh, Ganon's got two pieces of the puzzle. Yes. Um you knows who does not sound anything like Ganon, has two pieces of the puzzle. We just need the silver arrows. We can defeat the pig. And then we can rescue whatever Yunos is going to be rescuing. <laughs> uh, I believe in this, since he has the uh, Link's Awakening, Marin said he uh, saves Bow Wow. Ah, uh, yeah. Wait. That, that doesn't make any sense. Sure, you saved Bow Wow in Link's Awakening. You save Bow Wow in Link's Awakening, yes, but you don't save him as Marin. Oh yeah, but Marin's so cute. So yeah, this is a hunt for the silvers. I mean, RK does have the uh, compass, so knows uh, where the princess is as well. I don't think he has uh, seen or heard Ganon quite yet. They are both nearby each other, though. Now let's see what's down here. Heart container. Ooh, oh, just a heart container. Oh, boy. I don't think Yunos had seen that, so that's good. <laughs> and he, the RK is locked in this room. Yunos gets his compass for good measure. Yes, yeah, so it looks like, um, yeah, it looks like Yunos is, uh, there we go, we got yeah. a virtual high five. Yeah, I think, uh, Yunos is gonna go in here and find that heart container. So they're both gonna be, uh, have similar knowledge, I guess. Mm -hmm. Yunos only having the knowledge of, uh, you know, Ganon's location. This is gonna come down to the wire, I think, potentially come down to the wire, and that red ring at the wire could be a difference maker. That is true. So, so now here's the thing. I'm actually, you know, hoping for uh, Yunos to win because I'd love to see a game three of this. Yeah, I, I think most I of us would want to see that. I unfortunately did not see the first in the series, but you know, judging by, you know, the the insanity that has been these other series in the round of sixteen, um, I can just say it, it has to be an amazing game. I Whatever think happens. on that one, uh, I don't think it was as close as. I, I remember because I think Yunos just uh, unfortunately didn't dive uh, specific dungeons that RK did, and I I I don't think it was a definitely a, a close matchup um, on game one if I remember correctly. But it's been a little bit of time, so I may be a bit mistaken. But I, I think it was a, a pretty sizable um, yeah, but some, victory for RK. But some of the other one. some of the other matches have been absolutely ridiculous, you know, from you know other racers. Yeah. So Yunos up in A's, goes back to start. RK is in the top uh, right, is going to find Ganon over in this direction, I believe. Uh, I think maybe just right south of this room. 
So now they're equal on the knowledge. It's just who could get that silver arrow first. Yeah, so we couldn't bomb out that way. Mm -hmm. right, here they go. Both starting from the start now. Starting from the beginning here. So, so now it comes down to who's going to take the right path. And if you look at this, if you see that RKC's got eight bombs, whereas Yunos only has one. Yeah. RKC is going to stop here and take down this Dig Dogger. I don't know if Yunos did this or not. Also, I just realized Yunos only has 16 rupees. Yeah, a lot of rupee dropping enemies in here, though, uh, especially with the Zoles. So I, I, I can't imagine he's going to have a too hard of a time. And here they go. They're sort of leapfrogging over into this uh, right side. RK finds a new spot here. This was Zelda, though, so our uh, Unos has already been in this direction. And uh, Unos decides like... to leave and go get that red ring. Yeah. I mean, he's also out of bombs, so he is uh, trying to pick up bombs as well, but he's going to go get the red ring in the meantime. Yeah. Yeah, unfortunately, yeah, RKC does have a lot more staying power for, uh, you know, staying in this dungeon. Yeah. And I don't think this was a uh, bomb shop there. So, man, with Yunos not, he's not getting lucky on the bomb drops. He's already missed, I think, two. There we go, yeah. RKC, knowing the exact location of Zelda. He did have that compass. He, I think he's, I think, you know, both these runners are sort of in a nervous yeah, he, mode here. Yeah, it's it sounds it sounds like they're in. Um... You know, it, it, it's easy to forget that you had that compass or to not look at your map. You're just trying to go, 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 and get to any room that you haven't been to. They're they're in tilted mode, I think. I mean, I would be too. It's an hour eighteen. We don't normally see this from then, from Wiener's I mean, it's like you're. I mean, you're fighting Unos. You know mm -hmm. who Unos is. You're up a game against Unos, and you're like, I shouldn't be up a game against Unos. What happened here? And it's well, like, yeah, I think also on Unos' side, you know, he's fighting for his tournament life here. And he's like, this is well, the last what straw. Is this, what is this thing called losing? There they are, though. Oh, there we go. Yunos finds the silver arrows. I think that was a magic bomb hole uh, in the center of the map, basically. Yeah, basically lower center. RK is not terribly far. I think he has to go left, maybe left one more, and then bomb up. And wow. With the red ring, though, in hand. Oh, but look at that dwindling money supply. And he doesn't bomb up. That was the room he needed to bomb up in. It's only, it, there might be a different way in. Oh, he can go to the right. Okay. As long as he doesn't take this staircase. And he takes it. Oh, no. Okay, I can't well, blame him for that, but that it was just to the right of that staircase right there that he needed to be. And now he's off on a goose chase. This is now Yunos's to lose. I mean, it was before, but now it's even more. I think Yunos will have this. He has the red ring now. And he has Yunos. essentially 20 hearts. Yep. And Yunos is probably going to win with an estimated time of 1 hour, 21 minutes, and I don't know, 31 seconds. Uh, probably 1 hour. It's probably going to be closer to 1 hour, 20, maybe even under. Because he's really close. He just needs to go south, left, left. Like He's, yeah, he's going to be, be below hour 20 here. So we're saying 120.05. Let's see. No, not even that. Yeah, 119.30. <laughs> but yeah, sub sub 80 here for Yunos. There's Bow Wow. What a race. Wow. That was like quite back and forth with the items that they found. Uh, but Yunos, 
you know, getting that silver arrow, the the slight advantage into nine paying off, and uh, getting that silver arrow and finishing out official okay. SRL time one nineteen thirty five. And uh, the most important thing is, is that we are going on to a game three match. Game three tonight, 10 p.m. between these two. Who will go on to the top eight? We've already seen uh, a host of great runners uh, make it up into the top eight. Let me take a look and see who they are, just to make sure I confirm everything. Uh, our number one seed, RC Drone, is in top eight. Our number 25 seed, Adirondack Rick, is in top eight. Fearwolf, our number 13 seed, is in top eight. Uh, we are... Uh, actually, it hasn't updated on my screen, but Kevin856 defeated Shaddy uh, in a great series. Uh, if you haven't watched that series, please do so. Uh, so Kevin856 is in top eight against Fearwolf. Uh, the winner of this Unos RKC match tonight will move on to top eight. Uh, I believe it was... Uh, ooh, who won between Sightown and Greenleaf Effector? Had they done uh, their it was three? It was definitely Sightown. Okay, that's what I thought, but I didn't want to make a mistake. Sightown, uh, number seven seed, moving on into top eight. Uh, Crystal Saver and Redbird Grad uh, still have some matches to go. The winner of that is going to be in top eight, facing off against uh, myself, actually, in top eight. Somehow I made it up there. Rip. And yeah, RKC uh, sees the dot done from Munos and just uh, decides to forfeit out of here. This level nine giving him the business. And uh, it's unfortunate, you know, we don't have another race right after this, but uh, I think he's just sort of said, I've had enough. And we are joined by our uh, winner of this game two matchup, forcing the game three that we all wanted, uh, GG to you know. Hey. <laughs> okay, so what's your complaint for this seed? Oh, I don't, I don't know. I'm not gonna complain. You don't know, it was okay. I rolled it. Uh, I don't buy into that. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, that was, I thought to lose after not being able to check. Uh, okay, so I got a question. What's the floor item in five? Do we know? Greg yes. Handle. Red it candle. was it was ladder blocked in in uh, as a red red candle on the floor. Yeah, what do you know, like? Where in the dungeon was that? Because I was visited every left. room. Top it was actually left? fairly close to the Triforce, if I'm not mistaken. There was okay. a river room, and then there was a river room on the other side. Huh. I don't know what happened. If I misread the map or something. Anyway. Yeah, we saw that you had seen every room, and you're a little confused, and we wondered if uh, you know that might. Actually, if, if the Silvers were in there, it would have been a big play. But if the Silvers were not in there, you'd probably go back there last, knowing that you still had to find a room that you didn't get the item out of. So it actually yeah. worked out pretty well to do that. I, yeah, it could have been a disaster. And that's what I was ready for, but it didn't happen. What's up, RK? Hey there. Yeah, GG's, man, what a race. It was really back and forth between you two. Uh... You know, I guess I get your get your thoughts on this seed, uh, Ark. Yeah, it's just another rando. There you go. Exactly right. That is right. The, this is, you know, sometimes it comes down to just order of operations. Uh, RK had found the ladder first by a pretty significant amount, but <laughs> I think the uh, the one of the biggest differences uh, in this seed was. Yunos picked up the bow way earlier than RK and got the arrows. And with the amount of poles voice that were in these dungeons, specifically level eight, uh, Yunos could just sweep through. Whereas RK, even with the white sword, was still taking a much more time. And I think that probably was the difference maker in the seed. That's that's about what I'd hoped. Like, like I got the bow and then the arrows. I thought this is probably my advantage. And then with the ladder being where it was, yeah. Yeah. The, the funny thing is that Triforce and 8, I walked directly to it, but that wasn't necessarily anything that somebody should have done. There were any number of ways to go, but I just went right to it and I left. And I'm like, like as soon as there's an important item in this level, there's a good chance that RK will find it first. That's yeah. How it goes. 
But yeah, sometimes you got to make those gambles. You know who you're going up against is top 16. Um, you know, I can't I can't fault. And both of you made a slight gamble on level nine. Uh, I think I understand Yunos's gamble a bit more than RKC. Uh, I think if I if I saw it correctly, RKC left the item in level seven and went to level nine. Uh, you know, knowing that you had explored the same amount as Yunos, knew it was ladder blocked, knew exactly where to go, but decided to go to level nine. Uh, was that thought process just because of the time that we were at and the knowing who your opponent is? Uh, was it sort of a meta game thing? Um, I. I stumbled all over myself on this seed here. I went back and forth to levels, and I I don't know why I chose nine. I just I mean, it turned out to be the right play. It was the, it was the absolute right play to be. Uh, the silvers were in level nine. You were actually one room away from them. Uh, they were sort of in the middle middle bottom section. Uh, you were one room away and took a diamond staircase. It was near the end. Yunos had just gotten them and you were on the path to get them. And uh, it was just really, really unfortunate because that could have come down to a, a pretty photo finish, but I think Yunos would have slightly eked it out either way at that point. Uh, but it was a really, really solid uh, sort of back and forth between you two uh, on the sea. Kept it really exciting and close going into nine. I think there was only a, a I don't know, a minute or two difference of you of you two entering nine looking for the silver. So it really was anybody's ball game at that point. Okay. I was in six for quite a long time there. Um, mm -hmm. I got the ladder and went back for the trial, but I thought that I grabbed the floor item, but not the staircase item, but I was in reverse. I kept looking through all the rooms for the staircase uh, item. Yeah, we were wondering what the play was there because you both went back to six uh, after picking up the ladder. And I, I mentioned this, you know, because I think I, I, I've played Yunos and talked to you quite a bit. And I, I sort of had a, an idea that Yunos was going back in there just to get a Triforce and do something that he didn't have to think about while he planned his next move uh, of which dungeon he wanted to go to. Whereas I thought you were doing the exact same thing, but then you kept exploring a lot more dungeons. And that's where the big separation gap started to happen in level six. Maybe Yunos can confirm that or, or tell me I'm an idiot. Um, it sounds right. <laughs> yeah, the, the reason why I was exploring it was because I didn't know I'd already got the stair item. And I didn't even clear any rooms on those bottoms. I just looked in it, see if there was a stair, and then left. And I should have cleared them, really, because I needed the... Yeah, with that uh, power bracelet actually came up really big uh, for Yunos to pick up. You didn't really have to at that point, but then you found the ladder block, and that presents a very, very nice way to get back up to that level five spot, what housed level six. So, uh, really heads up play by uh, Yunos to grab that. Is that something you know? You, you sort of normally grab that power bracelet, don't you? Yeah, it, what I specifically had in mind is that I still had seven left to go to, which was at level six. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it wasn't on my mind to go back to the level five very, but I had to, I guess. Okay. Yeah, was, yeah, anytime that I haven't finished whatever is at level six and I see a power brace, I'm grabbing it. Makes sense. Makes sense. So, yeah, um, you know, what a great race. Uh, definitely worth a, a watch back if that's the thing that you do, because it was a very exciting uh, going into level nine. And we got uh, forced, forced into a game three scenario tonight. Another game three top... Uh, eight contender scenario uh gotta love it and that's going to be at uh, 10 p.m eastern tonight uh and i hope for another fantastic match between you two right on another crazy seed i seem to always get the crazy seeds i think you know with more items that are required you're going to get i think more more craziness uh, we've seen a lot of really quick seeds, but we've definitely seen in this bracket stages, you know, these type of seeds right here where one item is just really eluding you. Yeah. Got it. Got to get something to get something sort of scenario. Yeah. Ladder block is probably one of the most uh, time consuming ones because it means big fat. There's, I mean, what do you do about it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, all right. Thanks. Yeah. Thanks Thank for you. Thank you. Yeah, GG's to uh, Yunos, our winner of Game 2, and RK. Uh, great matchup, as I mentioned, and uh, we will get to see Game 3 out of them tonight. Do we have a uh, restream up for that? Uh, um, I would assume it'd have to be Randomania. 
Uh, I don't think it says on this. Let me update real quick. Yeah, I don't think we have a uh, a restream channel quite yet. Uh, could be on Randomania here, so uh, do check back 10 p.m. Eastern tonight for Game 3. And that'll be our last uh, Zelda 1 match for today. Uh, tomorrow, uh, we are going to have Game 2 of the and potentially game three of the redbird grad crystal saver matchup those will be on randomania beginning at 9 p.m eastern tomorrow night so uh definitely check that out that is another top 16 match to see who moves on to top eight and that'll close out our top eight uh, as of tomorrow night so exciting things in the zelda one randomizer community happening here and uh great players and great matches moving forward so Thank you so much for tuning in. Uh, thank you for our restreamer Random Mania and Spark over in the background and our tracker Boletta and my co-commentator Jiggly. Thank you. Do you have any final words on this seed, Jiggly? Go watch tonight's race. Agreed. Take care, everybody. Have a great Saturday.